Okay, so in this video I'm going to be trying to get Liam's Prom King ending. I know I have Damon's fight ending on a video. I don't know if I really have anyone else's endings or anything like that on videos. I want to say maybe I have Vera, one of Vera's endings, but I don't know. But I do know that I have Damon's fight ending, so... Yeah, but I'm just like, hey, why not try to get Liam's the prom king ending because i don't have either of liam's endings and i'm like i've tried so hard to get his endings and for some reason it's really fucking hard people say vera's endings are hard but like hers were actually pretty easy for me so i don't know for some reason liam's endings are just whatever um but yeah so i'm a one person a select term so there's first term and then there's second term um, apparently it's easier to get Liam's prom king, king ending with second term, because you can get two hearts, and apparently you need to get a heart for Liam and for Miranda, so I guess that's what I'm gonna do, I am guess I'm gonna do second term. Um, let me see this, because I know this has whatever stuff. No wait, this is that other secret ending. Because I saved some stuff on how to get different endings. Um, there's a list of all the endings, but like, hang on. If I go to this, that just says the stats on that. But like, I th think I read somewhere where you have to get multiple hearts. A heart for Liam and a heart for Miranda, so yeah, I don't know. Apparently it's easier on second term, so I guess I'll go with second term, and then I'm gonna go with short game. And I'm going to skip the intro, just because I'm sure a lot of people have already um, sure. seen that, so you know, I'm sure. Like, you know, these two games have been out for a long time, so I don't think we need to do that. So, um, I'm gonna try to get whatever stats that I need. So, most of the stuff I need is money. That's what really truly matters, I guess, for this run. But also I could see what o what, what other stats do I need for Liam. Um, so short single player hearts is seven plus and then smarts is 12 plus and creativity is 12 plus so i have to go smarts and creativity but i also need money so i should go with those three okay what question is this what would be the coolest prize you could find in your box of cereal so box of cereal Where's that one? So smart is a more nutritious breakfast option. It's a smart one. If you got a choice, how would you die? Okay, where is... How would you die? Where's that one? I don't see that one on here. Um, I guess it's because this is on second term and then the thing that I'm looking at is not second term. So, maybe TED Talk would be the smart one. Because I need smarts and creativity. So maybe I should go with this, okay. Oh, I should put it on with the wealthy one. Title of your autobiography. That one should be listed down here, right? No, it's not on here. Um, maybe, 
maybe that one, but at the same time, where is... I want to look up monster from second term quiz answers. I need to see that stuff. So I'm on title of autobiography. Title of autobiography. So Liam is the temporarily on. Yeah, I was thinking that one would be him. So I think there should be another one here too. Um, what would be the deal breaker for a potential lover? Where is that one? I think was up more. Deal breaker. Okay. The person lacks manners. That one's Miranda. So I guess I need a heart for both of them. And then now I just need to get money, I guess. And see if Miranda's gonna ask me to try to get him popular. Um, so, sure. I do need marks and creativity, but I also need money. I have a lot of smarts, so I don't really need that. Smarts is 12 plus. Uh, creativity I could probably get higher, but I'm trying, going to try to get money. Because that's what I really need for this. Um... Apparently, anyways, I only really need money, so that's what I'm going to try to do. Okay. Yuck! I simply do not understand this art you are describing. You say that the art piece is a bathroom. <sighs> For the hundredth time, the art piece is a... An experience of going to the bathroom thinking it's an art piece. The artist purposely gave the room number of the bathroom as the room number for the exhibit. Even though there was a whole room full of his paintings elsewhere in the building, it was revolutionary. <laughs> Certainly seemed very complicated. Personally, I prefer the Ex exploitant sub sculptures of the Atlantean 5th dynasty. Man on the moon, face on Mars, all of Pluto art on such a grand scale. So mainstream. That's not art, that's uh, populism at its worst. I don't think the bathroom business sounds like art. Yeah, that's kind of... But how are we supposed to... to discuss art if we can't even agree on what it is? If only someone could come along and provide a satisfying definition of art, it would be... I would be so pleased. You got this, no problem. It's so simple. So, art is the method for making worthless things into very expensive things. Art isn't art unless it makes you feel bad feelings inside. Uh-uh. Which one? But I feel like the bad feelings inside could kind of work for Liam, but at the same time he was saying like a bathroom is art even though that's, you know, which is kind of a worthless thing. I mean, bathrooms aren't worthless, but like, going to the bathroom, I mean, is that worthless? That's kind of a thing you need to do, but like, at the same time, like, I feel like a lot of people would just be like, 
anyone can do that, you know? So... It's not like going to the bathroom is really that amazing. Everyone can do it. Pretty much every creature on Earth does it, so it's not like, is it really hard? I don't know. She didn't really say anything about it. Bad feelings, so did she? I don't know. I mean, I guess it's kind of whatever, because, like... I, I need her to tell me about making Liam popular, so it's like, I don't know. You know. Whatever, I'm just gonna do that. Okay, I guess that was smarts, which smarts is... You know, whatever. Uh, Smars was just a bunch of sparsely populated red rock before Gilbert Grins Grinstone completed his masterpiece. After that, he was able to sell it to the our 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 crust. I don't I don't know if I can really say that for a trillion doubloons. The Martians weren't happy about it, but you know what they say. Sometimes we must suffer for other people's art. The last bit is the only part of what you're saying that I agree with. Okay, I guess I should have gone with the other one, right? But then it's smarts, so I don't know. But I got a heart for her when I need a heart for Liam. Smarts and charm. Okay. Um, sure. I need Miranda to talk to me then. Um, I guess. Whatever. Cool people table, we're all only cool people allowed. Mainstream. I would agree with Vera, just said, but. Agreeing is something only uncool people do. Won't you agree, Vera? Nice try, Liam, but I think we're getting away from the point. This... Okay, wait. Yeah, I want to sit over here. If he wants to sit with us, he's going to have to prove he's cool as we are. But without, like, trying to prove it, trying is uncool. So what's it gonna be? Um, well, I guess I'll be going then because there's no way anyone could be ever, ever be as cool as Liam. Let me ask you this. Would an uncool person be giving Viria 50 monster dollars right now? I do want to give her money, but I'm not going for her this round. I already have both her endings anyways, so you can go with this one. Wait, what's that? Sarcasm? No, of course not. Green was clearly being totally sincere. There it was again. You two are doing this on purpose. Now why on earth would we do that? I can't tell whether you're being sincere or ironic. It's so, so cool. Everyone knows clear and efficient communication is the least cool thing of all. You would me with your open disdain for language. I can't tell if you're being serious or not. Exactly. Vera and Liam invite you to sit with them and chat. By the end of lunch, none of you has any any idea what anyone else meant. So cool. Yeah, I don't know about that. <laughs> As an autistic person, I hate when people are... Sure. Like, jumping around what they truly mean. Like, just say what you really mean. Like, don't dance around shit. Say what you truly mean. Alright, so, Miranda, please, get over here. You money. Hmm. Miranda, please. You know, this Miranda trying to put a smile on Liam's face, this should be good. I simply do not understand how you can be so gloomy all the time when the world is so full of wonder and magic. I guess I'm not... I'm just not part of the everything is beautiful club. 
Everything is beautiful club. Is that a secret club? What? Oh yeah, totally. I want to join. I want to join. Oh, how can I join? Liam seems totally... <laughs> what? I'm continuing this bag, but you have no such... Okay. So I tell her... Fear and Lux just happen to have the membership paper right, right here. Magic is real. Super easy to join. All you have to do is eat a bunch of cotton candy and crap out unicorn. Okay. I, I just, I don't know. Like, am I gonna be able to do the prom king ending with this? Like, uh, I don't know. Last time it didn't work. Last time Miranda didn't say anything, but I also wasn't playing on second term, so I don't know. Um, I don't know, I'm just gonna do that. I guess that was smart, so cool. It's exactly what the bullshit fairy tale told me when we were playing checkers on the other night. Just those two things? No, you gotta write gullible across your forehead in permanent marker. Okay. Wait, seriously? But Miranda's already gone. When you see her the next day, she's leading a unicorn smiling from ear to ear. <laughs> I did it. The Everything is Beautiful Club let me in. I had to fill out some extra paperwork because I had my... Okay. Your man servant ate your cotton candy for you and picked it up. I made it up for it by tattooing gullible on his forehead instead of writing it. Oh. Okay. Well, you're welcome. Liam winks at you, and the wink is so full you gain two fun and one charm. I have too many fives on my thing. <laughs> It's gonna mess this up. So many fives. Come on, Miranda, I need you to do this. I only have so many things that I can do in one go. Um, well, since I have five of everything and money, how much money do I need for this, though? Um, I'm actually gonna check Monster Prom. How much? money do I need for from king ending so like again on the monster prom wiki it says this scenario is de entirely dependent on money stat so I only really need to get money, I guess. Number of events is three with choices, and I'm already this one and three more, so I don't know. So... The event will randomly trigger on Liam's route. Um... The intentional events can be made more likely by pursuing both Liam and Miranda. So, yeah, the, the second term DLC. As mo stupid as the monster prom, stupidest pop quiz ever has two rounds to gain hearts with NPCs. Ending can be achieved entirely with money stat, and completing it does not require Liam's usually, usual stat requirements. You can exclusively visit the library to maximize maximize your odds of success so i feel like i should just keep going to the library then but at the same time like i don't know but i mean i have money higher higher than like all my other stats so if i just pick the money options the entire time, then I think it'll be fine. But at the same time, I don't know. How many hearts do I have for Liam? Like, two? Which I don't think I'll have enough in this entire run, so... I... I don't know what to do then. 
I, I, I don't know. I'm gonna have to... I, I guess I'll just see how it goes if I keep going with money stat. Okay, so hopefully Miranda comes up here soon. Okay, Liam isn't paying attention to any of that. He corners you afterwards to lecture you on... Okay. No one seems to understand about filters is that they're not about making pictures better. They're about making pictures browner and harder to see. That's why I use my own okay, filter for most of my photos. Okay. It's probably also why I have only six Instagram followers, but Okay, I think this might be where Miranda's gonna try to get me to help her with this. So he is bringing up that he has only six followers. So... Miranda might come up to me after this, I think. In any case, I have to go. There's a dead rat in the parking lot. I simply must go. Okay. Okay, now Miranda's gonna come see me. As soon as Liam's gone, Miranda peeks out of the air conditioning duct. Okay. The situation is more dire than I thought. Yes! Oh my god. Like, I tried to make this video before of trying to do Liam's prompting ending, and it didn't work. And I was like, I guess I have to go on second term, because I was using first term, and I was like, I guess I have to go on second term to try to get it, and now... Yeah, okay. So now we got the Li make Liam popular thing. Okay, so... Chris, a part of my operation, I unwilling force people to do my service all the time. Okay, so why it's called that. He's been alive for like centuries, right? I'm sure he must have been popular at some point. I'll check the history books later. There's no time now. Phase one of getting the more followers. I took to the library of having my royal spies to cover the password to his account so we can give him a total makeover. But what to do? So, what I have to pick is... Because I have more money than fun. Obviously, because I have like six more money than fun. Um, pay millions of homeless people to follow, follow him. Okay, so the money one is pay millions of homeless people. Okay, so. Oh yes, just as father pays millions to vote for him in our fair and... Oh no. Bitch. That's not how that should work. <laughs> I think I can cut costs by paying one of father's... Okay, simply... Okay. Replicate the same thousands of people thousands of times, okay? Yes, Miranda, if she thinks this is ethical, but she is confused about the meaning of ethics as she's about fair and, I don't know, not, not, I don't know if she's really about the fair and whatever, the elections, like, that's not, that's not fair. <laughs> Soon the plot and the, okay, are hatched. You run into Liam in the halls a few hours later. I'm distraught. My carefully suspended un unpopularity is crumbling before my eyes. Look at all these followers. Look at their comments. Totally real account 66. I love you, Liam. Another equally real account. You're so obscure and, and vanguarded. The sentiments they are expressing are objectively correct, and yet, no, I cannot give in to the lure of... Okay. In spite of this, Liam seems to enjoy himself quite a bit. He spent the rest of the day helping him create his feed, gaining plus two charm and plus one fun. 
Okay, so it's not all five Sniffa there. So, at least it's kind of different. Okay, so the next sure. thing is... Um, how can we secure a win for Liam when he's successful with running or making an effort to win? Or when he's opposed, not obsessed, opposed to running and making an effort. So, yeah, I guess I'm gonna have to go with money again. Um, I don't think, I don't know if this would, I don't know if stuff happens really in the area for these routes, so. Okay, so, they're both upset. Why are you typing on your phone angrily? Did your phone offend you in some way? Why are you mad at it? You seem to be an 8.5 on the frowny Liam scale. The what? The frowny Liam scale. Normally, I can tell how people are feeling from their faces, but you seem to be frowning most of the time, so I created a chart to measure your frowniness. She pulls out a notepad that displays a series of doodles of Liam's frowniness. They're not super accurate, but they are super adorable. I'm not angry at my phone. My so-called frowniness is caused by an error. I specifically asked that my creature cream really be extra crispy, so it truly puffed with my... Okay, if you're okay. Instead, they burnt it to Chris, rendering it unphotographable. Monsters deserve to know what they're getting into if they choose to eat at this cafeteria. They can choose to take their business to a different establishment. And so I'm writing a. Okay, well. Welp review? You can't do that. If they shut down the cafeteria, the school kitchen staff will lose their jobs. Did you know that peasants have to do labor to make living wages? They don't simply have an unlimited store of gold. I was shocked when I first found out. Oh, of course you were. If the kitchen staff wanted to earn their wages, they should have been better at their jobs. I'm simply the merchant of truth. No, you're the merchant of poop. Their royal... Okay, sh Look, ask green. His taste may tend towards the mainstream, but surely you can see this poop hard cafeteria must be exposed. Don't be ridiculous. Green is surely more compassionate than that, and I would gladly help me save the cafeteria again. Again, gosh, it's hard to keep track of your misadventures at this sh shit show of school. Still, you hope if you can. Um, Miranda can't undermine Liam's balance. Good criticism alone, this will take an army of homeless people to pay to write positive wolf reviews. Okay. Liam, one lone voice, simply cannot shut down the cafeteria. At least not the voice of a high schooler. Let's get a renowned food critic to write a... Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna help him, I guess. Because I need more hearts for him, I think. So I don't. I I feel like I need more hearts for him. So I'm just gonna go with his stuff. Okay. So yeah. You think you have the most humility? You shall never be as humble as I am. Every day, my servants tell me I am the humblest person ever to live. Miranda storms off with a huff, leaving you and Liam to proceed with your amazing, incredible genius plan. You're super humble here. You need your magnificent skills to be picked up in your elective class. Okay. 
write five letters. Truck full of aesthetic. Liam produces a okay, delicate white stuff from his backpack. How is it breathing in there? And gives it to the newly addressed letters. You're not sure what's more intriguing. The fact that Liam trusts that the dove will be able to read the addresses to deliver the letters, or the fact that the addresses he wrote down were just their emails. Regardless, it seems to have worked, because within a minute of the dove's release, you receive your first reply on your phones. Okay. We got at least someone. Dear Liam, I received your message, although... Okay. I'm afraid I must give you the same answer I gave you when you asked me to write a review on cuisine cooked by your friend's grandmother last giving. I don't know how you got a dove to find out where I live. I live based on my email address, but stop contacting me. <laughs> okay, most lovingly yours, great and humblest food critic. Nobody understands the severity of... Okay. Thank goodness we have each other. Yeah. <laughs> Heck yeah, you have each other for from, hopefully, at the very least, at least maybe he'll let you borrow that dub sometime to send. Okay. Yeah, that would be cool. Okay, so... Sure. Now I need the third option for if this is gonna work. I still have a couple other things, so I know I could... whatever. I those, but I still need... I just want this to work. Okay, so I got more money. Okay, so afterwards, Miranda beckons you from a darkened corner. <laughs> okay. Um... Phase one of Operation Make Liam Popular Again was over overwhelmingly success. Liam isn't is internet popular. Now we just need to make him real life popular. Alright, we're on the second thing. Or I guess third thing, because on the wiki it has one where the number one is the event has to trigger and then the second is the what do we do and then third is this i guess so yeah make him prom king okay so unfortunately when i asked him to run for prom king he said and i quote never 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 not in a hundred years that's not an exaggeration because i've been alive for hundreds of years and um, i've never run for prom king so there you go which was clearly his cryptic way of saying he wants us to make him prom king. My first thought was to murder the current prom king after establishing Liam as rightful heir, but I couldn't find any bloodline bloodline charts for, to work from. So I oppose, suppose we must engage this. Okay. Now. How can we secure a win for Liam when he's opposed to running, making an effort? Okay, so... Charm is the dress up as Liam. And I only have seven charm. And then pay a million people to vote for Liam for prom king is the money one. So... I will go with that one, I guess. Of course, election rigging the old standby. I will summon my father's royal vote buyer immediately. Silly me, how else does this one elect a king? Later, you watch the problem king election forecast. You're not quite sure why your school has its own from royalty forecast or who pays for it. And says that, unsurprisingly, Liam will win. By almost one million votes, advantage. <laughs> A million votes. 
yeah, I don't know if that there's that many people in the school. I don't know what to say. Who knew there were a million monsters at the school who thought I should be pronking? Come to think of it, who knew there were a million monsters at the school? This burning in my chest is a shame at having la last became at last became mainstream, or is it joy? Yeah, are you shameful that you're mainstream now, or are you happy that you were voted punking? Nope, it's neither. I just need to drink somebody's blood. Catch you later. Uh, okay, whatever you say, I guess. <laughs> we does catch you later, and you take him out to get fresh a fresh tuxedo. He never looks out or you gain two fun and creativity and one creativity. Alright, okay, so hopefully the horse thing here. Sure. Um you tell Miranda not to worry. You've seen plenty of teen Ron comes, you know how this part goes. So when that comes up, then I'll be able to pick whatever. Okay, um, hopefully that's the next one. And then the last thing is just another thing where I can get a heart, I guess, for Liam. Okay, so Liam and Damon stand over a pile of books. Liam has scattered. They, they're scrawling intently as if the books have personally wronged them. Our school teaches the most common mainstream basic material imaginable. I think there's only one thing we can do, really. Petition the school to include works of value. Burn the books. <laughs> Damon, you're absolutely right. The fight against anti... Okay, must be... Telegraphed in strong action, not just empty words. Damon snaps his fingers, and the books burst into flames. You have to admit, between a petition and fire, fire is the much cooler option. Unfortunately, it's at this exact moment that crazy... Oh. Some... Um, a Martian chooses to appear? Oh no, 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 not, not again. He always thinks these things are my fault just because they are. I can't get detention, I'm seeing... <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. And the band only plays once in a blue moon. When the lunar eclipse lines up with... There's no time let, to let Liam finish. Quick step in and be a hero they need. Burn down the entire library. No point of origin. No proof of the culprit. Tell him there was three horned paper gobblers on the list. It was planning to devour the entire collection. Um, I feel like the bottom one would probably be boldness? And the top might be smart. Oh, it was charm? What's the other one? Creativity? Or bold- yeah, the, the other one must have been boldness. I do have more charm than boldness, so... Okay. Okay, so you launch into a chilling tale of the most dangerous of three-horned paper go gobblers to the loco. Okay. The gobbler would have surely have swallowed the whole library, you explained, if not for Liam's keen eyes and Damon's fur. Par 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 paranoia? The crazy Martian thing seems a sh Okay. The rivalry between were bears and paper gobblers is well documented. Nice going to do your real life saver and life after saver. Or after life saver. Now we'll be able to make that non-descript yogurt resort concert after all. 
You can come too as long as you don't do anything embarrassing like enjoy, enjoying yourself unironically. Liam even implying he's the being in public with you and Damon thinking you're useful. Nailed it. You gain plus two charm and one boldness. Okay. As long as those don't go over money and stuff, I think it should be fine. Because <laughs> I need my money to buy up. I gotta do the money stuff. Okay. Um, I need to get another heart later. Okay, so do we really need all these special forms? Can't we just write death threats on regular paper? For last time, uh, okay, we need to actually do stuff, I guess, to change things. What if we wrote death threats on really fancy paper? Liam turns to address you. As you can see, my mastery of real pol I don't know if it, politic has caused me to embrace an unlikely ally in the quest for reform. I have no idea what he's saying. I just want to. I just want the cafeteria food to stop being fucking boring. Okay, yeah, I mean, that's what we're trying to do, so I, I don't know. Sure, either way, we're stuck on the last bit. We know we want the menu to change, but we don't know what to change it to. Okay. What should I suggest? I guess the top one makes sense for Liam and the bottom one. Of course, knives would be a thing for Damon, so I'm gonna go with that one. To get an extra heart for Liam. That's it. Don't you see, Damon? It's bold commentary on the emptiness of. Okay. Sounds like a plate with a leaf on it. <laughs> yeah, it does. You never understand. But like, why even have a leaf on the plate if you're trying to be... Yeah. You're right, when... Why even have a plate? Why have anything at all? That's our new menu item. Nothing. <laughs> Nothing at all. <laughs> the school receives Liam's petition for now and the lunch line will include one empty tray, a giant victory for... Okay. Yeah, whatever. I just need to get to the last thing. I need the last one to be what I need it to be. Sure. <laughs> I need money. <laughs> money. I'm finally gonna get Damon's prom king ending. Okay. Uh. Yeah. Anyways, money. Money's the highest stat that I have now. Okay. Um. With that out of the way, you hurry away to your secret meeting with Miranda. Okay, well done. Operation Make Liam Popular Again is a resounding success. Okay, so for the record, I did discover that Liam was popular for three months per period in early 16th century. So the name fits. All that remains for us to wait for prom and celebrate our... Your deception? I knew it was too good to be true. Oh, he overheard us in our meeting. This was all a cruel joke, wasn't it? A bet between two popular kids that they could make an outcast loser into prom king. Well, guess what? The circus is over and this clown is climbing into his tiny car and going home. Along with the twelve other tiny clowns of the, if the metaphor holds, which it doesn't, it was a bad metaphor. Goodbye. No, Liam, it was, I wasn't trying to be mean. I don't have a mean bone in my body. I don't even have bones. <laughs> Fish have bones? What? Why wouldn't you have bones? What? <laughs> You're supposed to have bones. I mean... Are fish bones not made of the same stuff that human bones are made of? 
Like, they have to be, right? Or is it all, like, cartilage stuff? I don't, I don't know. Because I guess cartilage isn't really, you know, bone, so... Like, I guess if it was cartilage, then it wouldn't be bone, but, like... When you gut a fish, you have to remove the bones, so I... I don't know. <laughs> what kind of fish are you supposed to be? Are you not a fish with bones? I, I guess... I guess not. Yeah, I might have to check that information later, because, uh... <laughs> pretty sure fish have bones. <laughs> or at least, you know, when you cut open a fish to get the meat and stuff like you know they have bones like come on bro what oh fish sticks if we don't do something to fix this all of our hard work is super fudge and we be for not but how can we make amends surely with some sort of over okay romantic gesture defying all logic you tell Miranda not to worry. You've seen plenty of pain rom -coms. You know that how this part goes. Okay, so dress up as the- no, that was the previous one. You need to do a grand romantic gesture, and that is charm, and I only have nine charm. Pay a million people to spell I'm sorry, so it's visible from space, and that's money, so. I'm gonna go with that because I have more money. <laughs> Alright, so we hire a million idiots to spell the words out with their bodies. Just need to get Liam into orbit so you can see our heartfelt apology. What are you doing? Why did you strap me to this rocket? Calm down, silly. We're apologizing. Are you going to apologize for this after you're done too? Of course not, then we'd be apologizing forever, and I only have three more rockets. Okay, yes, great apology accepted. I'll be... I'll be the stupid prom king. Get me out of space. <laughs> I love making amends. Okay, I guess if you're willing to launch me into space to say you're sorry, you must surely care about me. And I must admit, it feels sort of good to be popular. Don't you dare tell anyone I said that. I promise not to tell anyone Liam said that, as long as he seriously considers taking you to prom. You gain two charm and one fun. Alright, now all we need to do is ask him to prom. And then I can get prom king ending! <laughs> okay, prom royalty. We did it. It was all... Our plan, we fought for love and loved one. We must popular again. Huzzah! <laughs> Anyways, after all these years spent avoiding cliches, this doesn't feel as bad as I imagined. It's so authentic. Maybe going a 180 degree turn from cliches is good, but embarrassing cliches is like making a 360 degree turn from them. So disruptive. Or embracing. No, I said embarrassing, didn't I? I, I meant embarrassing cliches. <laughs> okay, anyways. At that moment, Miranda became distracted by some other wacky plan and leaves you with Liam, mumbling to himself such a lovable dork. From night arrives and the two of you decide to embrace all cliches from slow dancing to actually having fun. Prom King? How ironic. After the coronation, Liam admits he's having uh, a great time, which is causing him to reflect on all of the cliches he's avoiding all of these years, which he could now embrace. Then he puts his hand over yours and says, And you know what the biggest cliche I've been avoiding is? Love. And don't even, and I don't even care how cheesy that sounded. That was cheesy, but you know what? You didn't care either. Yay, I got his secret ending finally after I messed up the first time. Or like, I was 
I was on my way to get his other ending, where it's like kind of a cursed ending. Um, and I was like, damn it, because like I could have gotten his other ending, but then it got messed up and yeah. So I'm gonna have to try to get his other ending another time. So yeah, I don't know if I'll do that in a video or not. I guess it depends if you guys want to see the other ending of his or not or whatever, but yeah. So... Best at whispering nasty stuff to birds. What? <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, I'm over 400 and still amazed at how stupid people are here. Yeah, I'm only 22 and I'm amazed at how stupid some people are. I just, I can't believe it. But yeah, I got, there's 47 endings and I only have 8. Kind of whack and then outcomes and events like there's a shit ton of outcomes and I'm not even like halfway there. I need to play this game more but it just takes kind of a long time to get through it that I you know it's it's a lot sometimes so yeah. Anyways um this is kind of just the same thing I don't think you know, this is really that different from other times, so I don't know. But. Oh, Miranda got a job at being princess of her kingdom. Uh, I think she would have had that job anyways. <laughs> yeah, I've already kind of her job anyways, so I don't know. Oh yeah, I think it's a different song for second term, and there's different artwork in the background for second term, I think, too, so... Anyways, that is it, I guess. And then I have unlocked four new images in the gallery, I guess. Um, I can check this. I got new here for endings. So there's that there. Yeah, I have like both of yours endings. I don't remember if I got those on video or not. But I know I have Damon's fight ending on a video, so... Yeah, and then there's more art. Okay, so there's 
whatever art here for the coven characters. But yeah, I actually finally got one of Liam's endings. Hopefully I can get his other ending at some point too, but yeah, I guess that's it. So, bye!